some hot chocolate. Thank you. Um. So, how'd you sleep? Oh, I slept great. How did you sleep? Good. I had a dream about your mom and I was just wondering how you guys got together. How I came to be. That's a really sweet question, baby. So it was way back in 2005. Let's go. Just in time. Lots of time for a big fat Thank you. Looks like Rick's missing his turn. Where is that guy anyway? That might be him right now. It's his bitch ass. Oh, dude, he's at the movies with you. I told you I was a Jedi. I feel this shit in my brain. I think we should just, you know, enjoy our college years. What do you mean, like seeing other people? Not that. Just not tied down. Okay. But more like friends. You know, benefits. And I cashed it. I'll smoke it all. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah, whatever. We got a little bit what left. It's no big deal. Let's go! Man, you a genetic experiment gone wrong, dawg. Game on, you... Oh, Jesus! Come 
man. Damn, it smells like heaven in here. What's up, man? What's going on, fellas? Hey, thanks, man. I left you a little nugget. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That is not enough for me to know. Yes! Yeah, but you missed 420 and pissed off the Ganji gods. Talking about, man, it's always 420 here. Besides, prepare to get your guts ripped out. Bring it. Well, Judy just gave me the friends with benefits spiel. Lucky bastard. You're free to play the field, man, out in the open, anyways. It's our last year of college, and I want to be a hoe. <laughs> Just that one. So? Her. Literally. Her cat. No, I wouldn't. But I would do it for science in your case just to do something sick. Check it out, the ultra death. Tight. You guys need another period? Yeah, I have one. Right? Yeah, me too. Man, you're better off single anyways. Friends with benefits, that sounds so good. Wish I had a fistful of bitches. Instead of just a fistful? Yeah, no commitment, man. Who wants that? Oh, crap, man. I should go. School starts back up tomorrow. Oh, man. Don't remind me. <sighs> to school! To school! Being drunk at school! Put your hand up, man! To school! Wow. All the women will meet tomorrow with hangovers. With yeah, hangovers. With hangovers. Yeah. Cheers, mate. School. Hangover. Hey, what are we gonna do? Stop off at McDonald's. I'm still living last night. So am I, man. I'm too drunk for school today. Man, you say that every day. Still no reason, man, we shouldn't smoke a fatty for lunch. True. Hey, ladies. That's tasty. Now, she is amazing. Who, the Spanish one? No, dummy, the one next to her. <laughs> Got jungle fever, buddy? Guys, she's a hot-looking chick. Father. You like black chicks. Man, I don't care what color she is. We well, should, man. You don't want to have a bunch of little black brick juniors running around. I'm sure your daddy, he would love that one. And I like beautiful women, and my dad doesn't choose them for me. Have you ever seen her before? Yeah. Her name's Nara, man. She's from Atlanta, Georgia. Hell, man, she used to go to the same high school as us. I don't remember her. Maybe you just smoked those brain cells away, buddy. Yeah, I remember the acid ecstasy shrooms your alcohol fry, man. Sure they did. Look, I still remember my locker combination from the sixth grade. It doesn't matter, man. She wouldn't go for you, man. She's too crude. Oh, really? I'll show you. I'll be right back. Yeah, let's, let's see, see it. Myself. Five bucks, is, he doesn't get a number. Not a digit? Nothing. All right, you're on. Hi, my name's Rick. How would you like to suck my little white dick? 
My name's Nara, and I'm real horny, and I like big black dicks, not little white shorts. How would you like to go out for some fried chicken? Oh, fried chicken, you say? <laughs> now that's so different. Pick me up at seven. Seven it is. See you there. <laughs> oh. Your lines are so cheesy. Cost 25 bucks, you stupid bitch. Teepers, that's great. I'll see you tonight. Five bucks. Yes. Hey. Wow. She is amazing. Her eyes are captivating. Oh, wow. Isn't that precious? Rick's craving fried chicken going for the dark heat over here. Shut up, dumbass. So what'd you say to hook it up so fast? I just told her I think she's beautiful. Beautiful? The truth? That's it? Basic? Simple? I have to try that sometime. There's 22 lovebirds going out. I asked her out for dinner tomorrow night. <laughs> so what are you taking her out for, Popeyes? No, we're going out for sushi. Sushi? I thought black people don't eat sushi. Well, Tony, I'm sorry, but as the days go on, you'll realize that you don't have shit. Cool, man. I cannot wait. Look, guys, I gotta get to class. I'll see you later on. Watch your next class. I was done for the day. Not done. Oh, crap, I got mad. Nuts. Truth? That's just sick. We should cook him up some collard greens, being from Atlanta, Georgia, and all. <laughs> uh, You're funny. I know. <laughs> what is that for? Speak of the devil. Who it is? What's up, guys? Don't you mean what's happening, nigga? Shit. Oh, you're a real comedian. No, hey, you're just in time for greens. Collard greens. <laughs> so tell me what you know about an aura. What makes you so interested, man? You could have any girl you want, like Judy, and get them benefits. I don't know, man. It's just something I feel inside. Oh, wow, Rick. That sounds so wonderfully magic and whipped at the same time. There are a lot of women out there that are beautiful and more right for you. Don't you mean white for me? Unfortunately, they're all the same. They're not different. Man, listen, I know you're hung up on this whole black-white thing, but I could rarely care less what other people think. You should, man. Everybody's hung up on colors. It's gonna make life rough for you. Nothing worth having comes easy. What do you think? I don't know. It'd be difficult. Your parents are gonna trip. Kiss your graduation to Europe goodbye. Yeah, my dad is gonna trip. You know what? I don't need him to pay for it anyway. I'll let the weed pay for it. I just wish he wasn't so close-minded and so damn prejudiced. Though. Prejudice? I'm so sick of hearing that, man. Black people walk around all day saying this and that. And if a white guy says that, it's shocked. Oh, come on, Tony. What about when you see a black guy with a white girl? Nobody ever says anything. You just walk away and act politically correct. But if a white guy is with a black girl, then a black guy's gonna jump you. No, it's not all like that. It's just the ignorant people are gonna think like that. Yeah, man, I don't know though. I mean, look at all these racially segregated organizations like yeah. the NAACP or the United Negro College Fund. Go ahead, try to open up the United Caucasian College Fund. Or better yet, the NAAWP. And blacks would just trip out. Racism, bigotry, prejudice. That's all you'd hear. Court battles and shit. Listen, I'll do what's right for me, regardless of what other people think. I wanna get to know her. She was a cheerleader with your sister. What? They were best friends. Well, you act like you didn't know her. She was in April's in graduating class. Hell, you had your eyes glued to April. Yeah, no, no, I didn't. Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes, they were good friends. And no, I didn't have my eyes glued to your sister, man. Right. right. So anyways, did I tell you she has a big black brother? I mean, he's a big looking, gorilla looking motherfucker. I mean, he's got nostrils, just, Breathing out, I hate white people. I mean, like, no, it's not funny. He beat the shit out of this one white boy because he whistled at his sister. What? Yeah, I'm to show you what bitch is. Yeah, we'll come busy in the hospital. <laughs> I don't know. I never saw her with the boyfriend, though. Maybe she's a virgin. A virgin? Yeah, right. There's no 20 year old virgins in California. You never know. Maybe she's different. Mm, virgins. Fucking Vaseline junkies. <laughs> Listen, Rick, 
I'm not saying that you shouldn't nail her, man. Hell, if you like dark meat, then go for it. But don't be exclusive with her, man. And for Christ's sakes, do not let other girls see you around her. Or adios, ladies. Have you ever heard of one guy, one girl relationships? Not everything in life has to be a damn porno movie. No, not everything. But I cannot believe I'm hearing this out of you, man. I've seen you with more girls than That was in high school, all right? This is life now. Yeah, you still are a pretty big man, Mark. <laughs> Do you believe in love at first sight? No. Not for men, at least. We gotta warm it up. We gotta, you know, test the engine. Women are just blinded by emotion. The first penis they get, they fall in love with. The question here is, Rick, do you believe me? I didn't until I met Anora. Do you? No, I mean, lust or obsession, but not love, not at first. You're just getting led by your dick, man. Look, man, what he says. I say follow your heart, you know what I mean? Everyone's just gonna believe what they wanna believe. And where do they get their views? Someone even more fucked up than that. Their parents. So do what you want. Quit being a bitch. I ain't no bitch. Get yeah, man. Damn, it's 1.15, man. I gotta go. I haven't been home for like two days. Hey, man, can I get a ride home tonight, man? Sure. All right, man. Later, Chase. Hey, later. Hey, man, what's your fucking problem? What, dude? You're f***ing this shit up. Back me up on this. Quit being like, he's gonna, gonna do whatever ruin, he wants He's anyway. gonna ruin his life. He's gonna do what he wants. If he ain't gonna Just listen to Just back me up, okay, man? Can you do that? I'm not, a, I'm not getting involved. All right, man. Peace. Thank you. Nice shirt. Thank you. Do you, uh, do you have any more classes today? Oh, uh, no, thank God. Ochem is enough for one day. Uh, having trouble, huh? I'm pretty good at it if you'd like some help. Really? Yeah. 
Hmm, my own personal tutor. I think I'll take you up on it. Cool. Why don't you uh, meet me for a late lunch? We can chat a little bit. Oh, crap. My brother's supposed to pick me up right now. Uh, really? Where at? I'll walk with you. I'm um, just around the building in the parking lot. Okay, cool. Let's go. So, uh, <laughs> so sushi today? Oh, man. My parents are supposed to go to a dinner party at 7, so maybe, I don't know, would you mind coming by my house and doing it? No, not at all. Around 7.30? Yeah. Okay, cool. So where do you live again? Oh, just a couple of blocks up, like two blocks. Oh, okay. That's a nice area. Yeah. Cool. Oh, hey, there's my brother. All right, girl. Okay, I'll see you later. I'll call you later. Bye-bye. Okay. Hey, dear. Who's the punk ass? Oh, um, that's just a guy who's going to help me with chemistry. As long as that's all it is. Sharon. Sharon's gonna buy this. Hey. Come in. Sure. Yeah, thanks. Wow, nice house. Thank you. You lived here for about three years. So this and I on continues to cause other anions and finally into... An oxide ring. Exactly. You're the best. Wow. I've never felt anything like that before. Let's do it again. Mm, my pleasure. Anything, anytime, anywhere. I'm all yours. You're mine. For as long as you want. Forever. Forever. That truck that just left. Oh, that was my friend. Actually, my new boyfriend. Your new what? That white boy? Yep. Now, would you mind closing my door? I'm in the middle of a text message. Yeah, I mind. Okay, later. I'll close my door. I'm gonna kill him. You're not gonna kill him either. Oh, yes, I am. I heard that. I've got you a little surprise. <sighs> Look at this guy. Looks like he just won a thousand dollars. Yeah, more like a million. You don't want another beer? Nah, I'm cool. Oh, I'm still full. That was your date. Great, man. It was great. Yeah? It's a good time, man. So, man. Did ya? That shit tonight, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like that car. <laughs> so when's the wedding, huh? March. Why? Who wants to be my best man? What? What? I'm just kidding. But we are going to be exclusive. Exclusive? What the f***, man? What about the single life? What about Judy? Screw Judy. Yeah, in the butt. Oh. <laughs> Listen to me. And understand what I'm about to say. Anara happens to be the woman that I want to spend the rest of my life with. So get used to it. Ever heard of passionate and companionate love? Duh. We took human sexuality together last semester. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. Why so fast? Because I love her. Then what's your last name, huh? You don't know! Woo! You don't know her last name, man. You say you're in love, man? You're just in lust, buddy. All those brain cells gone... been up from all the smoking weed. Tomei, all right? Tomei is her last name, and her middle name is Jeanne after her grandmother that lives in France. 
What else do you want to know about her, Einstein? Her favorite color? Food? What? What's your favorite color? Blue. Mine too. Oh, how cute, pussy boy. See, it's like I told you, Tony. As the days go on, you'll realize more and more that you really don't know shit. Cool, man. Cannot wait. Look, guys, if it's any consolation, I kind of agree with both of you. You're too much of a woman hater to believe in love, and you, my friend, you're on the love spaceship at warp speed. No, you know what I think? I think he's just afraid of love. You're damn right I'm afraid of love. And worst of all, I'd hate to live the rest of my life with some f***ing black bitch and have a bunch of little f***ing Rooney's running around my f***ing house. Tony, I don't care if you like or respect Anara at all, but you better respect me and how I feel about her and never say another derogatory thing about her ever again. You hear me? Ever. So what are you gonna, kick my ass? All right, man. Shit, sorry. Come on, guys, chill out. I'm almost done rolling this joint. We'll get high. Relax. Oh, you got one. Yeah, sorry, dude. I just want what's best for you, man. But hook me up with one of her Spanish friends. I want some Poonani, too, all right, man? Yeah, me too. Hook me up with one of those girls. Yeah, I heard there's a party Friday night. Yeah? We're going, man. Let's get some bitches. Oh, I gotta go hunting with my dad. I'm probably gonna miss it too, man. Besides, I've got a lot of homework to do this week. We're not gonna miss the party. We're gonna get some bitch Hell yeah. Hey, Tony. Yeah. That's a huge bitch. Oh, baby, what's up? Hey. Wow. Glad to see you. Hey, listen, you want to go to dinner right now or something? I'm sorry, I can't. I have plans. I'm meeting my girlfriend by the pond. Oh. Yeah. That's your girlfriend. Right. Well, I know. Um, how about you introduce me to her? All right. Okay? I mean, if you really want to. Yes, please. Okay. Okay. Sure. Well, I mean, where are you coming from? Um, art class. I was doing a, um, exhibit. Putting it together. Hey. How you doing, girl? This is Judy. Hi, I'm Rick's ex. <laughs> okay. It's so nice to meet you. <laughs> anyway, I've heard so many, just so many things about you. Thank you, nice to meet you. <laughs> anyway, I guess I should leave you two lovebirds alone now. I've got a million things to do anyway, so I hope to see you later in the day, though. Right. See you later then, right? Take care, Judy. Okay. Yeah. Have a good evening then. See you later. Take care, Judy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's cool. I mean, she seems nice. Yeah, I guess. Well, anyway, you look beautiful. I love your dress. Thank you. I love your glasses. They look cool. Thank you. Hey, did you hear about that party later tonight? Yeah, I did. Are you going? Oh, I wish I could go. I have so much homework, you know? So responsible. Is there anything about you that isn't perfect? What do you mean? Well, you're such a woman, you know? You're not like these other immature, visionless chicks in the Inland Empire. Thank you. So, are you going to go to the party tonight? Well, much to Tony's dismay, I don't think so. Chase is going up north hunting. You know, besides, I have a lot of homework to do. I'm kind of behind. Oh, leaving old teabag Tony to his own devices at a party, are you? Sounds dangerous. Sounds impossible. <laughs> yeah. Hey, tomorrow I want to take you somewhere special. Okay. I get out of class at uh, 10.30. Where are you taking me? It's a surprise. Oh, I love surprises. Cool. So when's your next class? Uh, like two hours from now. I was thinking I might go to the gym. On an empty stomach? Yeah. No way. Oh. Why don't you meet me for some raw fishes? What? Sushi. Oh, <laughs> sure. Come on. Yo, hook me up with that shit. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Tony! Hey, Judy. Hey, how are you? Nothing with me. How you doing? Good. So listen, are you going to that party tonight? I wouldn't miss that for nothing. Are you going to go? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I was thinking I'd really love to see Rick there. Yeah, he'll be there. Well, I don't know. You know, I bumped into him this morning and he said he wasn't going. His new girlfriend at all. Have you met her? Yeah, I met her. Do you like her? No. 
Not for him, I don't. I think he should get back together with you. That's what I yeah. think. The ore so on you now is out in color. Listen, I want him back. Do me a favor and make sure he shows at the party tonight and I'll make it worth your while. Yeah, okay. Got it? Good. What time is it, do you know? It's almost 4.20. It's time for me to get home. Right, me too. I gotta run and see if I can catch Rick getting out of class. So I guess I'll just have to see you tonight then, sweetie, at the party. All right, no doubt. Bring all your friends for me. Oof. Why can't I bend that over? Show her the dish, dish, dish. Don't do that to me again. Don't be such a creeper, man. So you're going uh, hunting, huh? Gonna catch you something? Hell yeah. Shoot me a piggy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Check this shit out, player. What you got? Double stacked ecstasy. Yeah. Where'd you get this shit at? Can't tell you that. Let me get one for the trip. Trip on the trip, huh? Hell yeah. 20 bucks. For sure. Check this shit out. Got some yeah, thank you, bud. It's called Royal Purple Madness. Oh yeah, it's half an eight for twenty-five. You want to trade for five? Yeah. Let's do it. Smoke a ball. Can't yet. My dad's gonna be coming. Smell it. Oh, that sucks. This is bomb. Don't mind if I do. Oh, I'm fucked up. My dad's hey, gonna be here. So, hey man, I'm sorry. I haven't smoked all day. Well, don't be such a fiend. He should be here in an hour. Give me a break, man. Yeah, it's a shame you're not coming to the party tonight, man. You're gonna miss out on Voltron's penis! Oh, f Tonight. Shit. They playing tonight only? Tonight only. That, get him a player for New Year's, off from 500. Dad, you don't need that. All you need to give him is beer, bitches, more beer, and weed. They'll do it for <laughs> free, you know? Alright, for sure. I'll organize it. Mm. Yeah, Paige. Do you mind if I um, use your phone? Yeah. Go use it back. I'll be right back. Dude, check out this new CD I bought. You ain't gonna hear this on the radio. Really? Hell yeah. Dude. Hello? Yes, hi, may I please speak to Rick, the pussy whipped kitty dick? I'm sorry he's not here right now. Is this Tony, the dickless, prejudiced brain donor? Yeah, yeah it is. What's up, stoner? Nothing, man, um, so, um, just smoking, gonna smoke a bowl. Capiche? Tell me something I don't know. Parties tonight? Like I said, tell me, tell me something that I don't know. Is your new girlfriend gonna come tonight? No. She's gotta study too. Uh, too? What do you mean, you're not gonna come to the party tonight? Dude, they're all the same. Judy's gonna be there, man. She was asking about you today. And? She shag her, man, for one last time. Dude, do you ever listen to yourself? No, why? Of all reasons to shag Judy, having a girlfriend that I happen to be in love with is definitely not one of them. Oh, that sounds like denial to me, man. <laughs> what? No. Um, all I'm saying is, man, that you should, um, don't party tonight, man. I think that you're afraid of women, that you're afraid you're gonna do something wrong, man. Just be a man! Just go and just tell Maria that it's gonna be okay, that you're not gonna cheat and find other people's butt, but just rock and roll! All right, all right, you know what? I'll go, okay? Not because of all this mumbo-jumbo bullcrap you've just been feeding me. It's because I gotta get out of this house, man. I'm losing my mind here. 
You know what? I'll meet you about 9.30, okay? And I'm telling you, Tony, I'm leaving at midnight. Where's it at? I'll call you back when I get out of shit, man. Here's the list of people who are Jewish. Just like you and me. What's up, no chase tonight? No, we're gonna chase every girl we see up in here. Or at least I will, you know what I mean? Chase the goodies around. Fucking guys walking through my way. Yeah. This is what we're working with? Yeah. There's some for you. Here you go. Hey, ladies. Hello. How would you like to smoke out of my pipe? Some marijuana. How about we go over there to that little pink little love nest and smoke that fish? Yeah, it's crumbly. Watch him. Hey, midnight. Baby! Hey. I can't believe you made it. Well, you look great. Well, thanks, so do you. Listen, I really need to talk to you. Um, why don't we go find some things private? Okay. Listen, how long are you staying around tonight? Uh, probably an hour or so. Tony, you know, Andy should be pretty much well, lost. Well, why aren't you staying around longer? You know, we had to have more time to talk. What have you got going that you've got to leave for? No, I, I have I have plans in the morning. With her, huh? Yes. I'm just saying your sister's boyfriend, man. He might know some new chick. What? I was just thinking, you know, we should do it, like, you know, one last time before you get married and have a wife. Just one last time for friendship. Yeah, no, I mean, no, no. Friends, yes, but with the benefits part, no. It's fine, okay. Enjoy your new flame. Just just know that these are going to miss I'm you. I'm going to miss them too, but you, you know what? I can't. I got to go. I have to go. No. Mm. I sure am going to miss that. Listen, you take care, sweetie. I'll right. see you around. See you. See ya. Man, I'm out of here. Hey! What's up? Hey, what's up? Aren't you my sister's new boyfriend? Well, who's your sister? I'm Nars, my sister, dope boy. Yeah, I'm Rick. You are? Now, why the hell were you tongue wrestling with that bitch a second ago? Oh, man, that's my ex-girlfriend. She's kind of tripping that I, I told her about an arm. I don't give a damn who she is. I think you were tripping on the tits. Science? Yeah, it was science. Hold on a second. <laughs> Hold on a second, okay? I don't want to fight you, okay? Shit, I wouldn't want to fight me if I were you either. You should have stayed with that white bitch. Look, this is what everyone's been saying. Too bad you didn't listen to him. I don't care what everybody else thinks. I think they were just trying to save your life. Oh, wait a minute. Wait. <clears throat> Hold it. What is my life worth if I can't have the woman that I love? No. Don't want to fight you. You win. Too bad. Win it. Oh, you put the wrong girl's, girl's heart, heart to break. break. Stay the hell away from my sister. Yeah, it looked like you should have got back with that wife just like she asked you. Oh. <coughs> now you have to taste my shoe. Fly. Oh, fly, What the f*** happened, man? What happened? What happened? Jared Tomei, that's what happened. I know, but what happened? Chilling at the party, next thing I know, he's talking to some girl, probably making out with her, man. Probably Judy. Jared Tomei, man. Bam! Put a foot up in his face. Oh man, I'll get him some ice. My eye. Ooh, you got f***ed up. Judy kissed me. And he saw it. And I was gonna it's think of cheating. Why don't you use any of that karate shit on him? Yeah! Huh? The karate. Whoa! 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 Huh! Huh! Shh, keep it down. Oh. Man, I knew I should have stayed home. You should have kicked his ass. That's what you should have done. Tony, you better shut up, dude. Guys, chill out. Uh, no, man. We always drop it, man. Let's talk, man. We're friends. All right. Talk. Oh, guys, chill. Uh, it's four in the morning. My dad's gonna wake up. Okay, okay. Uh, I guess I want to show you guys. Shit. I got me some new ink. Look at that. Dude, I don't believe you. 
What do you mean? Look at the way you judge me, man. I put white pride on my arm. And look how you judge me, man. It's not like I have white power on my arm. You're missing the whole point. <sighs> Shit, man. I'm not, man. You are. It's just like what I was saying, man. You got a million black people with their fists up screaming black power, man. But if I put a tattoo on my arm that says I like to have pride in my race, I'm considered a racist. Black equality in the fight from slavery was a freedom fight. Being prejudiced is passed down from generation to generation. It's like a virus we give each other. You know, like you uh, trying to give it to me right now. My dad just wants to keep this country pure, man. Being American isn't a color. It says everybody come together and let's melt as one. Just want to have it pure. Pure America. No, it's pure American. Man, I gotta get up in the morning. I'm tired. Think about it tomorrow, you'll laugh. I don't think so. Yeah, well, neither do I. Well, what was the point of all this? Dude, that thing's not real, is it? No. You think I'd really put something like that on myself? Just trying to prove a point to you, that's all. Hey, ma'am. Sorry about tonight. I'll give you a ride to your truck right now. Or in the morning. Whatever you want. The morning's cool. Great, guys. Next time we'll make some uh, popcorn and bake some brownies for you bitches. Having a midnight debate at my house and all. Did these guys even let the pig? We're home, aren't we? Big ass 80 pounder. I'll get the hell out of here mm. before I shoot you both. Can I have some food first? Alright, man. Hey, I'm just telling you what I saw, sis. This guy is a damn player. Why don't you believe me? Shit! Jaren, watch your mouth! Sorry, Dad. Anar, will you just come out here and talk to me? Jaren, I know you love me. And I love you. But I'm in love with Rick. And I don't know why he would be at that party or why he'd be kissing some girl. He was! She had her tits out and they were kissing. I'm not saying they weren't, but I know how parties are. I know how his friends are, one in particular. I'm sure I know what girl had her tits out, so I'm just gonna wait until he tells me. And he will. If he doesn't, I'll cut him loose. Come on, sis. Jaren, there's something about this guy. Something in the way he looks at me that... I don't know. I, I want my husband to look at me like that. Yes. He's the one. And if he isn't, I don't know that there is one. Be my brother and accept him. Someday he'll be yours. He'll never be my brother. Never. You're losing your mind, girl. I don't know what you're thinking or what spell this punk has put over you, but you're losing your damn mind. Jaren! Listen, you walk around with a glass heart and a fool like this will break it. And then I'll break him. Don't touch him. I, I won't. Until he breaks your heart. I won't put a hand on him at all. I promise. Thank you. But if I catch him messing around, and bet your ass I'll be watching, I'm going to beat the holy shit out of this fool. Fine, but check with me first. I might want to watch. <laughs> That's more like it. I was kidding. Don't touch him. Okay, but I still think you're crazy. And That's why you love me. Okay, bye, sis. Bye, handsome. Damn, son, what happened to you? Football accident. Mighty big football, huh? Yeah. I had a couple of those before. Come on in. Well, my name is Derek, by the way. Derek, I'm Rick. Nice to meet you. Pleasure. Come on in, have a seat. Okay. Anar, you got a guest? God, what happened? It's it's nothing. Nothing. I'll tell you all about it on the way. Are you sure? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Do you uh, need help with your things? No, no, it's just this one bag. Okay. Bye, Daddy. Oh, bye, bye. You guys take care. Drive safe. Now about last night. 
I was gonna stay home and, until Tony called. And, so. Well. And? And? Yeah, Cracker. Just keep on poking. Keep poking. So don't be mad at him. I know he's just protecting you. And believe me, I did not want to kiss her at all. I don't want to be with anyone in the whole world besides you. Are you sure? Yes. If I said that I wanted you to stop talking to her and never see her, would you stop? Of course I would. I'll have Chase tell her tomorrow, no problem. No, I don't want you to do that. I just... I just want to know that I can trust you. That it's just you and me. I promise, Honora. Being with you is, is all I want. You know, when I first saw you, my heart beat like... like I, I can't even describe it. But my heart has beat like that ever since. And I don't ever want my heart to stop beating like that. You know, you're my first thought in the morning and you're my last thought before bed. It's like the sunrise and a full moon. I know I sound corny. I, I, I just, I love you. I love you too. I can't, I, I can't explain it. I just love you with everything that I am. Ow, ow. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay. That's what I get for hanging around trouble. Yeah, I'll see. So, where's my surprise? Wow! Looks like an ocean of clouds out there. Actually, on a clear day, you can see the ocean. And you can see Catalina Island right there. Oh, I always wanted to go there. I hear it's really nice. Yeah, it is. It's pretty, pretty beautiful. Mm. So, when I was 17, I was in a car accident. And when I woke up at the hospital, I couldn't see. Lost yeah. your sight? Yeah. When I woke up, the doctors told me the occipital lobe of my brain was shocked. And they didn't know when or if my sight would even return. So my Uncle Bill used to bring me up here every weekend to train. You know, he was into Japanese mysticism and martial arts. Pretty amazing stuff. So then he guided me to see with my heart and my mind. It's called Haragi. So we did it every weekend for 18 months. And then my uncle died flying his Cessna up from San Diego to see me. Oh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have flown in that storm, but I guess when God's ready for you. So Chase's dad brought us up here every weekend, me, Tony, and Chase. So I just wanted to say goodbye. They led me up here and left me alone by the waterfall. Can you hear it? Yeah. It kind of sounds like the wind in the trees. I thought about everything he had taught me. It all made sense to me. I don't know why or how, but at that moment in my life, I experienced peace and happiness like I'd never felt before. Until now. Maybe it was him. And I started to cry. Then what happened? When I wiped the tears from my eyes, I was looking at the waterfall. I don't even know how long I was there.
Do you believe in love at first sight? Yes. Me too. Anara, I can't picture my life without you. And I know we've only been seeing each other for a short period of time, but I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I want you to be my wife. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look, you don't have to answer me right now. And I know it sounds a little crazy for me to ask so soon. <laughs> Believe me, I'm not usually this spontaneous. But when I know something in my heart is right, I do it. Last night, I had a dream that we got married. And there isn't another man on earth that I'd want to spend the rest of my life with. Is that a yes? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Mm. <laughs> hey, let's go get rings. What? Right now. Right now? Let's go right now and get rings. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Dad, I didn't see you there. Come Good on in. Good morning, son. What's new? Nothing. Why? What's up? I dropped by the mall yesterday to drop off my watch, and Janice told me that you're in with a beautiful woman picking wedding bands. Aren't you going to let us know? Are you going to elope? No, I was going to I was gonna let you know, yeah. So tell me about my new daughter-in-law. I hear she's beautiful. She is, and her name is Honora Tome. And? And I'm in love with her. Well, I'm happy for you, son. When are you two planning to get married? Well, you know, we really haven't gotten that far yet. I can't believe I'm hearing this words. The guy who's getting all these phone calls from all the girls. She's awesome, Dad. She's, uh, she's also African-American. She's what? She's African-American. Janice didn't tell me your friend was black. We can't pollute our bloodlines with Negro genes. Dad, please, please don't make this an issue, okay? I've got a lot of problems because of this. There are plenty of women out there. White women. Is this how you got the shiner? No, actually it's not. Prejudice is the reason I got this. Son, think about this seriously. Think about your career with our company. To be more shiners, you'll pay for this big. Don't try to bribe me, Dad, okay? She's my future. Well, then you have your future, and you'll have it without me and not under my roof. Come on, I really need you to support me here. Listen, I'll be leaving on Tuesday. I'll pick up your mother at your grandmother's and I'll see you Friday at Powell. Fine. What if somebody told you not to have married mom? Would you have listened? Man, that's different. No, dad, no, it's not. It's no different. You know, love is love and you can't stop it. You know, it's it, the, the difference is all in your mind. Mine is wide open, and it's not filled with the illusion of racial superiority. This isn't about racial superiority. It's about the pureness of the ancestral lines. Dad, you sound, and you get this from Grandpa. You sound just like Grandpa did. It's a wonder that you and Uncle Bob don't get along. You, you are exactly alike. Don't make me cut you off, son. You sound just like your Uncle Bill. Well, I guess we don't have to worry about that anymore now, do we? At least he loved me enough to let me find my own happiness. If you, if you want to cut me off for being in love with Anara, then, then cut me off. You know, I'll, I'll move out after graduation. Fine. Dad. Thanks, Dad. Shit! Besides this, great. 
Nice shirt. What's next? An afro? What's that on your finger? Is that a ring? A ring? I asked her to marry me. What? What could have possessed you to do something like that? You've only known her for two weeks, man. Dude, what are you thinking? This is really quick, pal. Real quick. Passionate love quick. What can I say? She's the one. She's the one. Well, great. I hope we get to see you every once in a while. What is this, goodbye? Obviously. Look how you've been the last two weeks. You come over here after you drop her off for curfew. What's next? You still gonna come with us wakeboarding this weekend? Of course. I put everything on my car, even the room. Everything's set. Dude, don't act like this is the end of our friendship. Don't miss it, man. It's Labor Day weekend. I'm gonna get inverted this trip. I bet you 20 bucks he doesn't show. Why you gotta act like this? Why do I gotta act like this? Why can't you understand that this is my life? Well, you're throwing yours away. Got some girl f***ing up your head and shit, making wedding plans up, and to top it off, she's a n oh, 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 Sorry. I told you not to badmouth her. You are sorry. She just hooked up with Judy when she asked you to. What? Yeah, you heard me. F***ing assholes. Tony. Tony, come on, bro. Tony. Tony. You cocksucker. Man, I can't believe this, Chase. I bet it was Judy, Jaron, his freaking little sidekick running around, and Tony. I bet they were all in on this, man. You think so? Yeah. Meet me here at 9 a.m. Bring your guns. I'll see you then. It's like the whole world is against us. The whole world is against you, man. I mean, you got all these people that want you to think, act, like, dislike, accept, and neglect everything that they believe. Whatever that means. Hell, I mean, look at Tony. I think he got the way he is. Pressure from his parents, man. I just want them to believe what they believe. People are just so shallow, but she isn't. I'm as comfortable to hang out and talk with her as I am you. She know you smoke? No. You gonna tell her? If she asks. Pour me some of that. Sure. Don't get me wrong, man. I mean, I like Inara. I just think you guys might have rushed in a little bit. Yeah, but you guys have said it yourselves that this isn't me. Nothing's wrong with me. Stellar. I know, man. I, people just don't fall in love like that. Not anymore, anyway. Yeah, but you know what? I felt like my life was complete until I met her. And now that my life is complete, she's all I want. Really? Yeah. Well, then I'm happy for you, then. I just hope someday I find someone like her. You will, man. Yes, yeah, someday. Well, shit, man, I gotta... And tests I gotta study for. You know, those midterms are coming up. It's getting late. I'm kinda behind, too. Let's first blast these cans, though. Yeah, for sure.
Nah, probably like a B or C. So then what are you worried about? I'll probably get a hundred bucks for every day for starters. My GPA too. I just hate the tricky way questions work. I think you usually messes me up too. I guess they're not designed for stoners. Maybe we should quit smoking pot. Someday, maybe. But the way things are going right now, I don't think that'll be anytime soon. Dude, I was just kidding. Never to quit. Never? Why? I don't see any reason to. You sound like Tony. I mean, what about health? This shit is like recreational. What about love, huh? Love the way it makes me feel. Love the way it tastes, the way it smells. It's just like you and Anara. What? How do you figure? Well, for starters, it would be healthier for your life if you abstain from it. But you love her, and the way she makes you feel. So your addiction's kind of like mine. Well then keep on smoking, brother. Have one like that. It's called paintball. Oh yeah. And you're gonna be a doctor? I'll be your doctor, fool. Doctor Stone. Groovy. <laughs> so you wanna get some beer or Playboy got plans tonight? Ah, my dad's leaving tomorrow afternoon. Nora and I are gonna get some pizza and watch a movie. Oh, so that pizza pie. No, none of that pizza pie. What? You're gonna have a house all to yourselves. You know you're after the dudes. Look, she said to me that she wanted to save herself for marriage. What? Don't lie to yourself, there's no way. Wow, that's just weird, who does that? That's like one in a million, hell, one in five million. That's why you want her, some of that tight ass shit worked to shit. No, don't be stupid. Kidding. I know you like her, but when we get back, we gotta get some weed, I'm it. No, we don't have to get some weed. You have to get some weed. I already have some. What? Right in my back pocket. Hi, caramba. Pack that. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to pack it. <laughs> For sure, it's yours. <laughs> and please, don't be skimpy. Throw a lot in there. I won't. Okay. Let's get high. Hey. You look beautiful. I love that. Thank you. <laughs> so hey, it's two more days until we have ourselves a four-day weekend. Oh yeah. You'll be in Powell. That's right. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Are you still gonna be uh, spending it with your friend in Santa Barbara? No. She um decided to go to San Francisco to see her boyfriend. Are you kidding me? A boyfriend in Frisco? How gay? <laughs> yeah. Come right. On. Tell me the truth. What are you gonna do? Um. Well, let's see. My dad's going to be deep sea fishing with some guys from work, and Jaren is going to be in Havasu. So, hmm. I guess I guess I'll be all alone. All right, I won't have it. Why don't you come with me to Pal? We have a, a family boat. We have a ski boat. I could even teach you how to wakeboard. Come on, you'll love. It. Oh, I don't know. What about your family and your friends? I worry about them. Besides, you're going to be in my life forever, so they better get used to it. <laughs> Look, with your personality, I'm sure you'll win. And then uh, everything <laughs> will be groovy. Oh boy, I don't know. Um, you're sure? Then I'll go. Cool. Wait till you see this lake. It's big, it's beautiful. I mean, the water is like glass. Oh. Can't even describe it, you just have to see it for yourself. I can't wait. Cool. Hey, I want to ask, did you, uh, you bring your bathing suit for our jacuzzi? Yes, I did. And wait till you see it. <laughs> can't wait. Step girl. Where's the bathroom? Oh, it's down the hallway to the left. Okay. Hi, big brother. April! What are you doing over already? I came to drive with you guys to Powell. Cool. Yeah. So, oh, what's up with this letter dad wrote you? What letter? What are you, what are you talking about? Said, don't go bringing no Negroes home and do what's right. Did you bring some black stoner dudes home? What? No, no. no. Don't. Oh, oh my God, Anara! What are you doing here? Oh, hey. We're engaged. <gasps> what? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, it's beautiful.
beautiful. When do you date? Mm. We're actually not sure yet. Probably after graduation really? sometime. Okay, yeah. Sense. So how's San Diego? I love it. It's it's beautiful and it's fun and it fits me, you know. Mm. So I actually think I'm gonna stay working at SeaWorld because they offered me an internship through the college biology department. Nice. Wow, you're working at the college and SeaWorld. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Hey, how come I never met Anora if she was your best friend? You know, you were always all friendly with your friends. Mm -hmm. You didn't have time for us. But actually, she has met Dad. You met my dad? I didn't know that. Yes, I have met him before, and I mostly remember that he didn't really like African Americans. So maybe I should. No, no, no. We'll all go. Don't even yeah. worry about Come that. Come on, we'll have a good time. Don't worry, it'll be fine. Yeah. yeah. Even if we have to go down to Nantica ourselves and do a little wake party. Yeah, we'll have a good time. Mm -hmm. Promise. I don't know, babe. I want to go, but I just feel really uneasy about a nine-hour car ride, and I'll be feeling like I'm going to ruin everybody's good time. Fine. Then you and I, we can have our own weekend, okay? We'll go to Rosarita. We'll make our way up to Dana Point. We have a family boat there, and who knows, you know, have some lobster and whatever. Oh, I don't want you to miss your fun trip with everyone. Yeah, you have to come. I want to be with you, okay? I want to do everything with you. I don't care about anything else, all right? We can do whatever we want, you know? Trust me, we'll have fun. He was talking about me in that letter, wasn't he? So you told him about me? Well, yeah. I, we had a talk the other day. And I told him that I got engaged and that you're African-American. And what did he say? Well, he said that he cut me off. <gasps> what a jerk! You know what? It doesn't matter. We can do it. No. Me and you. It does matter. Okay, but it's not going to stop us. I know. I know. I think you guys should do the solo thing. Show them where your priorities are. I'll give them a little piece of my mind, too. Oh, no, April. I don't want you to cause any trouble. No, don't even worry about it. I do it all the time. And she's good at it, too. <laughs> yeah. Don't even worry about it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you going to do tonight? I'm going to go down to downtown with the girls. And actually, oh, we're having um, like a little pool party thing at Amber's tomorrow. Oh. So I'm going to call you in the morning, okay? I haven't seen Amber since grad night. Yeah, I know. She's been working at some web building company. Yeah. Amber? Yeah. So apparently she's good at it. So, yeah, I'm so glad you're going to be nice with Oh, me too. We're going to have so much fun with the little gatherings and we're going to rile everybody up. Oh, no. Yeah. I'm in trouble. <laughs> hey, before you go, I want to ask you a favor. Anything. Will you be my maid of honor? Oh, my God, sweetheart. <laughs> What's up? Oh, my God. Oh, yay. <laughs> It's gonna be so fun. I'm never gonna hear the end of this. Mm -mm. Oh. All right, I've gotta go right now, but I'm gonna see you guys later. Do you do you do? Bye. Bye. Huh? Yeah, do you like iced tea? Oh, I love iced tea. Oh, good, me too. Wow, this pizza looks great. It smells pretty good. Mm hmm. So, what movie are we gonna watch? I got you better roses. <gasps> really? Mm -hmm. That's one of my favorite movies. I wish my first time could be just like that. Hmm. I kind of like it too. Although the guy's kind of, you know, whipped on her. Don't you <laughs> think? Well, I mean, like, psycho whipped. Hmm. Look, sometimes, I gotta warn you, during movies, my eyes, they kind of get a little teary-eyed. I think it's from being, you know, a little tired. Ah, these tired moments wouldn't happen to be during the sad parts, would they? Sometimes. Sensitive guy, huh? No, it's not that at all. 
it's just, you know, going into film, I love great storylines and cinematography, you know what I'm saying? Hmm. Well, I do too. I imagine our eyes will get tired at just about the same times. Wonderful. Join me. That looks good. It does, doesn't it? Fire is roaring. It is, isn't it? I love wood burning. I love the smell. Yeah, it's nice and warm. It is. Alrighty. There we go. I love watching the previews. I do too. It's good tea. Yeah, he made it. I make it. I want you. Believe me, I want you. I really do want you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Look, but I want you first time to be special. I will be special. I'm gonna be so special right now. Okay, that was fun for us, really. Hey. What? Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. Tomorrow. Okay. Tomorrow. Hurry up tomorrow. Wait, you don't think I want to go? Of course I want to go. I wanted an R to go with me. But my dad, he left me a nice little racial note at my house, and now we can't go. Man, I cannot believe you're gonna give up wakeboarding for dirty ass Mexico. Wait, you don't think I wanna go? Can I right, dog? Yeah, I wanna go. But if it's between an R and my dad's Ten Commandments, then I choose an R. Good, there's always next year. Is one woman really worth all that, Rick? Yeah, she is. So how are we supposed to get there? Bus? No, oh, dumbass. April is going, and you'll be riding with her in her truck. April's going. It's not too bad. And she's bringing a friend. She's bringing a friend? Yeah. Things don't look too bad now, do they? Still sucks for you, man. You know, gonna miss out on a good-ass time. Just be at my house at 7. As long as his ass gets up. No problem, dude. We're still partying tonight. Partying tonight. Yeah, of course we're partying tonight. Tonight's yeah. the night. The, the night, 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 like this, this, this. Hell yeah. I think it's beautiful. These two guys are like made for each other. I know, right? Nice ring. Have you given him any yet? No, but tonight's the night. And I was an Virginia. Oh God. <laughs> I leave my new sister in law alone. Yeah. You should make sure he's a good boy now. What do you mean? You know what a pimp he was in high school. Mm. I don't know too much about high school, but I haven't seen any signs of that. And you won't either. See the way he looks at you, it's obvious that he loves you. Really? Yeah, really. And you know what? I think I remember us all being a little bit of a hoe in high school. High school? Hell, girl, I'm still a hoe. <laughs> I need to get that money. I watch them drop when they got keys in it. I don't blame them. <laughs> You're a hoe too, April. Yeah, okay, I've had my moments. Once. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Once. Okay, maybe twice. <laughs> but now, I'm a bit of a hoe. That's right. Mm. Bitch. <laughs> Alright, last one on the pool. It is the biggest hoe of hoe too. Uh-oh, we put. Hmm. I'll gladly claim that title. Watch your step. Oh. Stop. Can I open? You can open. It's perfect. You're perfect. And you are too. You make me better than I am. Got a little music? To you and 
We should do that every night. <coughs> <coughs> okay, I guess we can make love every night on our way up the coast. Mm -hmm. So today we're... Going to Rosarita, mm -hmm. get a room, go dancing, have some lobster and beer and put in the wave home. Of course. And uh, do some shopping in the morning, make our way up to Dana Point to our family boat. Uh, maybe spend the day at sea. Sounds exciting. And then uh, we can go to Catalina Island and do some scuba diving. Oh, isn't that dangerous? No, but I mean, we don't have to if you don't want. No, I want to. It's just, um, it's nothing. I want to do everything with you. Cool, we can go to all the little shops and little corner stores on the island. Do some more shopping. I like to shop. Me too. We're perfect for each other. Yeah, then we can sail back Sunday morning, spend the night, and come back home Monday. That's perfect because my brother and my dad don't get back until late Monday night. What do you think about a shower? I think that is a wonderful idea. the border. You gotta be kidding me, man. <laughs> How do people run down the freeway here? <laughs> wow, I just want to stationary. Selling goodies, I'll be running after people too. <laughs> <laughs> Come on in. We can start joining. Oh, it's cute. Wow. Where's the bedroom? Right there. Inside there. Oh, now that's a good sized bed right there. It's cool, isn't it? Want to go test it out? 
Mm. You know it. Watch your back. <laughs> Watch your back. Watch your back. April. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up with Dad leaving all these notes? Yeah, he left another one on the boat saying, do not use the boat without captain's orders. What's up with that? All right, you know what? It, it doesn't matter at all because we're already here at the island. Yeah, no, I, I know you told him. I don't care. All right, whatever, Stoner. Well, how's things going out there anyway? Cool. Cool. Yeah, we're having a great time so far. Yeah. All right, you know what? Hey, I gotta go. But uh, I'll talk to you when we get back. All right? Tuesday. Take care, bro. Bye. Mm -hmm. It's called Rattlesnake Canyon. Are there rattlesnakes there? I don't think so. The reason they call it Rattlesnake Canyon is because the canyon comes down, and as it goes into the sea, it, you know, kind of weaves back and forth. Like, like a like, snake. Like, like a snake. Right, nice. right. And every September, hammerhead sharks go there to mate. Really? Really. I mean, it's really cool. My dad brought me there a couple years ago. Mm -hmm. And we were just so amazed. I mean, it's just, we couldn't believe how many, you know, sharks were actually swimming right around us. You were know? you scared? A little bit. I, I was a little bit scared. I'm sure my father was too. I was so scared. When you look at them, you can see them looking right in your eyes. And if they weren't, you know, in it for the douche, then you, definitely they would have eaten us. What's douche? You know the douche, douche, douche. <gasps> oh my goodness, that's what you've been whispering in my ear all this time? Right, right. You're such a verb. Hey. <laughs> what time does the boat leave tomorrow? 10. And I ate you, my lady have a diving class, and after that, then we'll go out. There's not gonna be any sharks out there, are there? I can't promise anything, but look, I'll be right there and so will other divers. Okay, well, as long as you just stick really close to me, then I'll be okay. You trust me, I will, absolutely, I promise. I'll be right by your side. I will be, side by side. Are you gonna eat that salmon or are you just gonna I am going to eat the same and then I'm going to feed you some. Sufro mucho tu ausencia. No te lo niego. Ya no puedo vivir si a mi lado no estás. Dicen que soy cobarde y que tengo miedo de perder tu cariño, de tus besos perder. Yo comprendo que es mucho. Two weeks, 17 days. Oh boy. Yeah. I'm so not ready for this. It's probably just nerves or something. I hope so. Nara to me. So, uh, we'll know tomorrow? Jay Clock. What do you, uh, what do you want to do if it's positive? I don't know. I mean, I'm not ready to have a child yet. And I'm not ready to have an abortion either. What do you want to do? You know, still get married, have a baby, you know, if you want, it's your body. This is all so much. Let's just wait until the results come back. Maybe it's nothing. 
I mean, I've been late before. Yeah, I mean, we use condoms, you know? Except for that one that broke. Oh, yeah, I remember. Hey, okay, look, no matter what we do, you and me, we can conquer the world. You're so positive, I love that. I promise. Okay? Trust me. Wanna get out of here? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, if I could please have you turn your books to pages 219. We'll be going over chapter 19, which is... I seen them earlier, man, with some BT white girls, man. Man, like they're about to kiss. I'm telling you, man, that's disrespectful. The substance will now try to form another bond in order to balance itself out and neutralize itself. Or the entire benzene ring will split. Hey, yo, man, is that him over there? Also with a negative charge. Also with a four negative charge. A bond. A benzene ring. Mm -hmm. Our aromatic a bond. like to ask a question. Uh, anyone here like to suck my What? Chew that son of a bitch. It was positive. I hope you're not disappointed in me. No, of course I'm not. Why would I be? I don't know. What do you think we should do? If you don't mind, I'd like us to keep it. You know, I know we weren't ready yet, but I am ready to spend my life with you. I want to have your children. Look, we can get our own place and we'll do whatever it takes. <laughs> hey! What the hell did you do with my sister? Baby girl. 
So everything worked out. Come in. Dad came around. Hi, how you doing? Good, how are you doing? Good. Been missing my son. Hey, you know, I miss my dad too. I've been a jerk for the last year. Can you forgive me? Of course I can. Look, we all don't get there at the same time. So this is my granddaughter? Yes, it is, Alexis. You want to hold her? Yeah. Hi. Everything like it was meant to be all along. Tony came around. What up? What up, buddy? Scoot over. So what you been doing? <sighs> Nothing. Nothing, huh? No. Been seeing my sister lately? Why? Been spending quite a lot of time going to San Diego these days. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I got some benefits down there. Let's give it up for benefits, so, huh? Yeah. Well, I redo. Whipped. Hey, light it up. What's wrong with your hand? You know him? Yeah, what's wrong with your hand? What are you doing down there? Playing with your hairy nut bag? Yeah, sure. Sure. That's what I'm Son of a oh. bitch, I knew it, Chase. <laughs> April wasn't shitting me. <laughs> Shit, no, I can't believe it's it. It's not what it looks like. <laughs> it's not what it looks like. I'm just playing the game, you know what I mean? You're mm -hmm. whipped, and you're whipped. Mm -hmm. No, then both of you are whipped. You know what, you're the one who started the whole whipping thing. Yeah, but you really are whipped. Yeah. Fuck you, man. You're whipped. Okay, look, why don't we just agree that all three of us are whipped, all right? Cool? And I knew we would be. Because isn't everybody in that right, Chase? Yeah. I guess we can't help it. Everyone needs love and companionship. I think I'm gonna puke. That's all, you folks. Have a good one. Gosh, Jim, that was such a beautiful story. So why can't we leave us? You know, sweetheart, that's a whole other story. Thank you.